So let's begin the yoga for complete beginner. Sit in any comfortable position that you are comfortable in. And uh, yoga is done in the bone, not on the muscles. Muscles are used with the bones. And uh, first we work with the bones and the muscles get stretched and relaxed together with it. So let's work on the bone joint with it. So sit in any comfortable position and begin back straight. Keep your breathing normal. Take your hands straight and start to move your fingers. Especially use your thumb because that's where your focus should be because the thumb normally don't move. And when you're moving your fingers, you're working on your neurons to activate. So each and every neurons that is connected to those fingers movement are getting activated. Now stretch the fingers and make the, make the fist. Stretch the finger, make the fist. Keep your breathing normal. Just normal as it is normally. Don't worry about breathing yet because these are fast movement and for fast movement we don't want to do fast breathing. We want to do two or three breathing. Uh, two, sorry. You want to do two or three make fist and stretching of the finger with each breath out and in. So you breathe in two or three times. Open and close the fist and breathe out for two or three rounds. Now stretch the finger and work with your wrist. Stretch up and down, 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 up and down. Now make the fist and rotation of the wrist, wrist joint to release the air from the bones, from the joint of the wrist and make it more flexible. Keep your breathing normal and other way around. Focus on your hands, on your wrists. Now turn around the palm and for your elbow joint, so Bend your elbow, touch your shoulder and stretch your hands. Bend and stretch. 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 Keep your breathing normal. Don't choke. Now to the side. Same same thing. Bend and stretch. Bend and stretch. Bend stretch, bend and stretch. Keep your breathing normal, just normal breathing. Don't worry about breathing too much. Now bring your fingers on your shoulder and make as big circle as possible. That's for your shoulder joints. So all the knots that you create on your shoulder, on your shoulder blades will be removed. So about five rounds, three, four, and five, other way around. And breathing can be normal again, doesn't have to be worrying about the breathing. And you can close your eyes if you want and focus on the movement. Now we are going to work on the spine and on the side. So hold with your right, left hand, the right knee. Inhale, bring your right arm up and with exhale bend towards the left. Inhale, come back, exhale, release, change your hand. Hold with your right hand, inhale, left arm up and exhale, bend towards the right. And come back up one more time, inhale and exhale. And one more time, inhale and exhale. Make sure that you're feeling on this part is stretch. And come back. Now the twist for the spine. So again, hold with your right, left hand, the right knee, bring your left, right hand on the back. Inhale, lift your chest up and exhale, twist.
and back to the center, inhale and exhale to the other side. And back to the center, inhale and exhale to the other side. Back to the center, inhale and exhale to the other side. And back to the center, inhale and exhale. Now we work on the feet, on the legs, to so stretch the legs out. You can bring your hand on the back and lean a little bit backwards and rest at the same time working with your legs. So first work with the toes, so bend your toes. And stretch them, bend them, and stretch them, bend, stretch, bend, stretch, bend, stretch, bend, stretch, bend, stretch. Now the ankle joint. So open your legs slightly wider, and then bend your elbow, or bend, bend your ankle joints, and stretch. Bend forward, bend backward, forward, backward. Forward, backward, forward, backward, forward, backward. Now the rotation of the ankle joints and it's going to make your ankles flexible. So rotate them and again keep breathing normal. This is complete for beginner people and you cannot do anything wrong as soon as you're doing the rotation and bending. To the other side. That's right. Now sit straight, sit on the sitting bones, bend your right knee, bring your chest up, hold your inner thigh with the right leg, lift the leg up and stretch the leg and bend your knee. This is for your knee joint. Stretch and bend. Stretch and bend, stretch and bend, stretch and bend, stretch and bend. Now lift the leg nicely up and make the circle of the knee joint as big circle as possible and do this with care, not push too much, do what is comfortable in your body. And rotation on the other side. Breathing normal and back straight, it's very important. If your back is hunching, it's not good, so you have to have your back straight and doing the movements. And release. Repeat the same with your left leg, lift up, stretch the leg, and bend your knee. Stretch the leg and bend your knee. Stretch the leg, bend your knee. Stretch the leg and bend your knee. Stretch the leg, bend your knee. Stretch the leg and bend your knee. Now make the leg up and make the circle as big circle as possible. Keeping the breathing normal. Make sure to have your back straight, shoulder down, chest up, other way around. And relax. We do the half butterfly. So take your right foot onto your left thigh, hold with your left hand like this, the foot and one hand on your right knee and inhale, lift up, exhale down, inhale up, exhale down, inhale up, exhale down, inhale up, exhale down, inhale up, exhale down and inhale up. Down and then make a rotation of the hip joint to make the flexible of your hip as big circle as possible. Keep your breathing normal again. Other way around. Keep your back straight, that's more important. So you're not hunching this way. Keep your back straight and then relax. And release. Change your leg. Take your left leg up. Hold with your right hand the foot. One left hand on the left knee. Then inhale up. Exhale down. Inhale up. 
exhale down, inhale up, 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 exhale down. Now rotation of the knee joints or hip joints, sorry, as big circle as possible, but keeping the back straight. Keep your breathing normal and keep your right foot active. Make sure that it's not loose like this, it's active. Other way around. That's right. And now full butterfly. So join your feet together, hold with your hands the feet and lift your chest up. Lift your chest up, do what is comfortable, don't need to push anything and shake your knees. Keep your eyes closed, focus on your hips. Keep your back straight and make sure you're sitting on the sitting bones. Gradually stop and keep your chest up and press onto your knees. Keep normal breathing. If you can press all the way down, it's okay. If you cannot, just push as much as possible without strain or pain. And that's right. So now this is complete. This is yoga for a complete beginner, and that's the warm up part. So you can do this, and after that, you can move on to practicing asanas or the sun salutation, or you can stop here. So that if you do this for about 15 to 20 minutes every day, that will be enough to make your body more flexible and then move to the second level, the advanced level. So thank you very much for watching me. And if you like the video, then please share with your friends so they can also get some benefit with the yoga and subscribe so that you can get my next video. Thank you very much. Namaste.